I know that when we talk to folks, the number one thing I always hear is, oh yeah, great, real estate, awesome. If I would have done this 10, 20 years ago. You want to tell us a little bit about your experience of like at your age, making this an asset class that you invest in and like how the show fits into that? Yeah. So one day my son-in-law, he sends me a link and he says, listen to it. So I click on that link and it's JWB. And uh, I said, okay. So I listened and I thought about it. And then the next day they asked me, hey, what did you think? I say, interesting. So Keith Weinhold was on your show and I listened to him. And after the show, well, before the show was over, he said real good stuff about JWB. And I said, I have to check these guys out. So I asked if I can join JWB chat in uh, webinars. And that's what I did. And I listened to you all for about maybe four to five months. And then I decided, okay, it's time to buy my first rental property. So I dived in and I bought my first rental property. I think that was in 21. And then I've been pretty steady, you know, on this show. I love all the people here. I learned from all the people here. I learned from Greg, I learned from Pablo, I learned from Lee, Jan Filson, Ken, and, uh, you know, a lot of good experienced investors in here. I'm, I'm just a baby, I'm a newbie. So anyway, then in 2022, I bought my second property. And after that, I went ahead and I, you know, spread my wings a little bit. I bought a property in Texas, I bought a property in California. I bought a property in uh, Arkansas. So since then, you know, I went in partnership with my son-in-law and my daughter, and we bought a fourplex and we bought an 18-unit apartment building. Uh, Congratulations. Go. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. And my plan for this year is to add two more properties to my portfolio and one is going to be with JWB, and the other one I haven't decided yet. So that's my story. I'm sticking to it. Wow. Well, congratulations. That's awesome. Wow. Thank what you. a story there. And if I think about what drives me on this show is, you know, bringing access to this asset class to everyday people. And when people can understand this asset class, you know, it should have a seat at the table in their financial portfolio. So what brings me to just getting excited is, listen, people don't have to buy all of their properties from JWB, but you know, when you start, when that starts to click in your head and you're like, I can have rental properties in my portfolio. And then they start to build out their portfolio. And many times that's with JWB, but many times that's with, you know, different places in the country too. That is a huge success of this show. Oh. 